Hi everyone, uh, my name is Clara and I am the writer and director of the movie Nzara Hunger, which is a movie that we are creating right now, that we are making right now, that is based on a myth that comes from Great Zimbabwe. And it is a myth about the Roji Empire uh, trying to steal the moon out of the sky because they think that she's a plate. Uh, and in our story, uh, our story tackles the theme of hunger and actually heals it, heals the broken heart that is at the core of the big hunger that is eating the entire world right now. Uh, and this movie, uh, this story actually, because it was initially a play and uh, it was shut down uh, in Zimbabwe, it, was, it had its first premiere, its performance in Zimbabwe and then it was shut down by the police, it was censored uh, by law and order and this uh, broke our hearts the people who were involved in the play uh, myself included it was a really heartbreaking experience uh, to see this myth that at its core again it is talking about the healing of the hunger it is talking about uh, the woman in the sky coming down and teaching us again what it means to love Then we got a grant to take the play to South Africa. However, with the current virus situation, we decided to use that grant money because we have to use it somehow. We want to use it to make an animated movie and we've already began, begun that process. However, the grant money is just not enough to cover the costs of all that is involved. Uh, recording the artists in Zimbabwe who are in Zimbabwe right now, uh, the animators who are in Poland, myself, who is in Poland right now, who will also be recording. The Zimbabweans who are in Poland right now, who will also be recording. So we have this whole project, but this is not a project about Zimbabwe. This is a ceremony play for the world right now. Um, this is a story that will feed us with hope. Uh, it will give us that innocence that all of us crave again. Um, after taking us through through the darkness of the hunger. That is when the hunger began. Because when a king's grief explodes, it punches holes in the hearts and stomachs of all people. Even the sky is shaken by the grief of the king. Even the rivers dry up so there is space for the tears of a nation. The moon sang songs then. Everything else cried. I feel very strongly about this, this story, actually, because this was a story that was given to me by the moon herself when I was at Great Zimbabwe. And the moon told me this story. And it was such a remarkable story. And I said, ah, okay. I will do my best to tell this story. I will do my absolute best to tell this story. And, uh, and that's why I pushed it so hard. I pushed it so hard to perform it in Zimbabwe. And uh, again, we faced so many troubles of uh, lack of money and space and the situation in Zimbabwe and no electricity and um, just a bit, a lot of chaos. Uh, and we, made something beautiful, we really did. The music of it, and the story of it, and the actors worked so hard. Uh, and, and then that story was shut down. The reaction to it was such, the pain maybe that the story brought out was such that, that, that it was shut down. So now we are calling for a healing even of that pain of the shutdown. Uh, a healing that will result in an animation and the word animation doesn't do it justice because the animation world allows for the beauty and the magic and the color the myth to come through as well as the music and the words and that to be offered to everyone in the world um, for humanity to see itself again, to feel itself again for what it is. Um, 
by being told this story that comes from one of the most sacred places on this beautiful planet. Um, yeah, so I really hope that you will be part of supporting this, uh, this endeavor, this venture. And bless you, bless your families, bless everyone. Thank you. Hi guys, my name is Joseph Jesse Americano and I'm an artist that is based in Zimbabwe and actor. So I'm here to talk to you about the play called Zara, the movie. Yeah? So I think the world must watch Zara because Zara is one movie that speaks about how people are developing their culture, how people are derailing from their ways. So Zara is a movie that will help you understand the culture of Zimbabwe. Uh, the culture of the people of the Rohi state. So it also tackles the issue of how how men doesn't respect women. Uh, it's also it also talks about rap, yeah. So I think that uh, it's a play, it's a movie that is an eye opener. So if you want your eyes to be open, if you want to be open minded, if you want to know your culture, you, yeah, and stuff and stuff, I think you should. Uh, watch Zara the movie it's coming soon here yeah? so keep on watching and keep on waiting for Zara please like our Facebook page it's Zara the movie our Twitter also is Zara the movie our Instagram handle is Zara the movie it's going to be a bomb you all have yeah.